Hi everyone. So there are some things you just need to memorize for AP Chem. And some of these are the common polyatomic ions. Now luckily, there's a simple little device called knob, cob, soy, poi that can help you memorize nitrate, carbonate, sulfate, and phosphate. So here's how it works. Knob shows you how to form nitrate because the n tells you it's nitrogen and then the ob tells you how many oxygens go with that nitrogen. See, because the three looks a lot like a B, so O3, OB, ob, and then the whole thing, knob. Cob shows you how to form carbonate, because the k tells you it's carbon, and then the ob, just like in nitrate, tells you there's three oxygens with that carbon. Soy shows you how to form sulfate, because the s tells you it's sulfur, and then the oi tells you there's four oxygens with that sulfur, because the four looks a lot like a y, so oi. Poi shows you how to form phosphate, because the f tells you it's phosphorus, and the oi shows you there's four oxygens with that phosphorus. Now knob, cob, soy, poi can also help you memorize the charges. See, because the charges go negative one, negative two, negative two, negative three. So all you have to memorize is one, two, two, three, knob, cob, soy, poi. Now I've also made an extended version to help you memorize a couple more polyatomic ions. So I've added sitob and croy. And they follow the exact same pattern. So sitob is si, silicon, with ob, three oxygens. So silicate. And then croy shows you how to form chromate because the ker tells you it's chromium, and the oi tells you there's four oxygens with that chromium. And then this also helps you memorize the charges because they still go negative one, negative two, negative two, negative two, negative two, negative three. So knob, cob, sitob, soy, croy, poi. One, two, 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 three. I hope this helps.